Welcome to Somewhat Awesome Films, my name's Jared and I'm playing Devil May Cry and I'm about to tackle the succubus or poison. It's one of the bosses in the game and anyway there's a bit of a cutscene that happens to begin with so we're just going to watch that first. So you must be the secret ingredient. Prime date, you ugly sack of shit. Who the fuck are you? You missed my name, by the way, is Dante. Dante, son of Sparta. Yeah, but you can call me Dante the Demon Killer. Has a nice ring to it, don't you think? You want to kill me? You can't kill me? I'm 1200 years old! You don't look a day over 12,000. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! <laughs> So much swearing involved in that one, isn't there? But um, anyway, killing the succubus uh, took me a little bit to kind of not figure out as much, but just not die over and over. But he spews out this uh, this this poison all the time, which kind of gets you. I think it's the ingredient that they put in the energy drink virality, I think it's called, um, and it kind of kills you. So what you got to do is before he sprays it all over each floor, you got to keep using your you're hooking sort of swinging across to other platforms and, and wait till he gets there and just beat the crap out of him. And that's pretty much all there is to it, but you get caught out a little bit there and he, he claws you and does some other things, but it's just time consuming really. There's an example of where I uh, kind of didn't do it in time, whatevs. I wonder if, uh, I wonder if Red Bull's like this. I wonder if there's some massive succubus that's putting the ingredients in Red Bull's or V's. Maybe. I don't know. A little bit of a worry. Maybe we should start a mission and go down and, and try these things. But there we go. Just kicked him in the face. And now I've got to use Demon Pool to kind of unhook these little tubes. Which I'm guessing where everything goes down. It's all pretty self-explanatory. He really is an ugly boss, isn't he? It'd be a pretty crappy life. got to say, I'm a fan of Angel Lift in this game, it is kind of good fun, and it's good to actually have a boss fight where you sort of, you need to use these things, and uh, I haven't yet sort of figured out how to dodge him blowing his bad breath on you, and every now and again I get caught, I think, not looking where I'm jumping, and kind of be mindful that you got to kind of jump left and jump right, eventually you get to a dead end and there's nowhere to go. <laughs> And I think, I think I may have even fallen into the big pit of lava or Red Bull, whatever it is. I used to drink a Red Bull every morning when I got up. I'm pretty sure that was really bad for me. Maybe I had cancer. Hopefully not. I really should get checked out. And there's all boss fights. It just goes on and on. And I just keep hacking and hacking. I've got to say, I think in this game, I don't really use Rebellion that much. I tend to use Arbiter and Osiris a fair bit in this, and I forget sometimes that I've got Rebellion. It's just so much quicker. Oh, that's how you beat the uh, breath. Just step back. I love it when it's that easy. Here's uh, hack, hack, hack. I think uh, when, his, when his head goes red, just kind of smash that. What I'm doing, and don't die like I am. I'm jumping. So I've been, uh, I've been, I've been getting into playing this PC copy. I know everyone's been bitching about the 30 frames a second on the consoles, but I've got to say, if you've got a decent enough PC, definitely uh, give it a go because I think everything on this looks really stunning and the action's awesome. But I've had a look at some comparisons of uh, consoles to PCs, and uh, I don't think they're that bad. Consoles still look alright, but I know that a lot of the motion blur and these fight scenes aren't as great on the consoles. 
No kick in the face. Ooh, punch in the face this time. Demon pull that one. So much swearing, so much hate, all this anger, what have I done wrong? I just wanted you to stop trying to kill me, that's all. Then you just come and swear and ain't cool. So I think when, uh, I think when his head's not red, you, you don't really do any damage from the looks of it. I think all you can really do is just kind of like chop his hands and that's where he's just destroyed that platform, so I shouldn't have jumped that way. That's cool, and I'm actually about to die. Which isn't good. Unless I can kill him first. It doesn't look like it's gonna happen. Hmm. Mm. Don't die. And I died. Gold orb. Cheating again. Don't judge me. You would have done the same. Hopefully. Maybe you wouldn't have. Maybe you'd have been better. Probably knowing my skills at this, you most likely definitely would have been better. But that's cool. Fun game anyway. Even if I do die all the time. So close. And demon pull his face. And this is a pretty cool little ending cutscene where you just gotta do a little bit, but he's pretty much dead now. There's a much much more to it than that. Succubus. Zero. Dante one. And uh, run a little bit and be. I do like how the, uh, the cutscenes kind of really do flow seamlessly into the gameplay, which is kind of cool. Yeah, it's pretty funny, actually. I had no idea what I was doing in this. I ended up just kind of demon pulling an angel, pulling everything, and it all seemed to work. Since looking back on it, I've kind of noticed all the little orange circles there, and we're like, ah, I was supposed to do that. All good. <laughs> that was where I tried to do a demon pull. <laughs> Trial and error. Best invention on any game. And here's the end of Red Bull. I think you're all mixed up. Punchline. Great one liner. And now you get Eric's big ass fist.